here's a nice fall view of the sesquicentennial state park parking lot look at the color contrast in those trees Even more impressive is this view down toward the lake. This again from the parking lot. The lake has had some treatment, which it sorely needed, and now looks much better. I'll have to put a kayak in there. There's plenty to do here at Sesqui for young and old. We'll go over and take a look at that playground, but I believe it's one of those new ones that are so expensive and so much fun for little children. Fortunately, there's a grant associated with them, or so I've heard. Yes, indeed. That's exactly what this is. It's one of those impressive playgrounds little children love to play in. It even has a speaking tube over there. Here's a plaque that says that this playground was built through contributions from the Lipscomb Family Foundation, the Bonner Family Private Foundation, the Bose Corporation, Joyce Hampton, Klein Iron and Steel, Shakespeare, that's the uh, fishing line people, and FN Manufacturing. They uh, manufacture another kind of equipment. So there you are. These things don't just happen. They have to be planned for years since the budget doesn't allow that you should just see the children play on these. Here's another one of these playgrounds. Not quite as elaborate as the one toward the parking lot, but still very nice. This was supported by a grant, I presume, from the Land and Water Conservation Fund. You can see the tag here. I'd been coming here for 10 years before I realized that the park also maintains this very nice ball field. Baseball and other kinds of ball, I presume. Over here, in the distance, you may be able to see a class being taught by the interpretive ranger, Stacy Jensen. She does a number of these a week sometimes a few a day. I mentioned a while back that Sesqui, a few years ago, built new restrooms, or renovated restrooms. Here is one in the main picnic area, convenient to the path that goes around the lake. It's a beautiful facility, and as well maintained inside as it is outside. No visit to Sesqui, at least for me, is complete without at least a short visit to this wonderful little lake. Looks like it needs a, an inflatable, foldable, advanced element kayak paddling around in there, doesn't it? Wish I had the time to come over. <laughs> 